Right, Honorable Pri uh, Prime Minister, right? That is 10 million. I have the honor to comply with His Excellency Directive to hand over the 20 million shillings to the Chairman Ajumani Engine. And I want to all lend, not give, lend. <laughs> This word is deliberately chosen. <laughs> Lent to pass the course. So that RDC tomorrow, when his, his job of sharing this task force is over, I expect you by my vote back. <laughs> but right now, you can use it. You can use it to strengthen these people who are looking on at the, uh, our border, which is water to patrol it, I think it will help to patrol. And if somebody knows this water is being patrolled, you will not dare. You see, all these water bodies, some people can come because they know nobody bothers about this area here. They can come and enter through Kejikeji, then come through Panya 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 and then they cross. One of the very commonly demanded explanation from the district health office is food and non-food items, which are beyond the mandate of the Ministry of Health and the mandate of the district health office. This requires working with the office of the Prime Minister to ensure food and non-food needs, including psychosocial support, gender issues, human rights issues are addressed. Ajuman is one of the refugees hosting districts. It must be well utilized as a problem. So, let us use it the way it is supposed to be.